Um, yeah, I read on the Raspberry Pi forums that it was possible to drive the Raspberry Pi at 4K, just at very low refresh rates. And uh, since I'm actually already using the Pi for a bunch of, um, basically I'm using them as uh, art displays all over my apartment, um, I thought I'd give it a try with one of them. That is a 4K uh, LG monitor. So I'm going to go reboot this bad boy and then show you the entire boot sequence over here. Um, so basically on the forums, uh, Dom suggested a bunch of uh, uh, configuration parameters to put in your boot config.txt file. Nothing too crazy there. Um, it results in 4K at a, like a, I think it's 15 hertz. Um, so again, so you can see the lightning symbol. I think I'm, I have this guy undercharged. Uh, yeah, that value is coming directly from Qt, uh, the querying Q screen to see the actual size of the first screen that's attached. Um, so what's interesting here is that this is entirely non-hardware accelerated. Um, the reason for that is the fact that I cannot create an EGL surface, which is uh, uh, at that resolution. Um, I get an, like a, a B300 error message. Um, which I'm not quite sure what that resolves to, uh, but anyways, uh, normally everywhere else I'm running this, we are actually using OpenGL ES2 and, and full hardware acceleration. Um, on this particular wall, uh, I'm actually just using the frame buffer device. So this is launched with um, the Qt Linux FB device. Uh, this is using the actual Qt Quick 2D renderer. Um, so my application is just a QML application. Uh, I, I, I really had no interest in trying to make uh, a rasterized application work on the Pi. Um, but the 2D renderer was there, so I added the single uh, API call that Leslo shared, which indicates that you actually want to use the software backend for the declarative engine, and voila, this thing just came up. Uh, this was literally zero effort. Um, yeah, so like a, it's really nice. I'm a very happy camper. You can see how slow the, the animations are. Um, I need to write a different display of this artwork now that uh, is more static. Um, but apart from that, I'm a very happy camper. Cool. Cheers.